One Bennett Park is really the culmination of 25 years of great buildings in Chicago and a collaboration with one of the great architects and designers in the world. I spent a summer living right there on the lake to have access to the lakefront path right outside of your front door, to be five minutes from downtown Chicago. It was such an incredible location um, that when the opportunity arose, we jumped at it. We wanted to build a legacy building, a building that will be as great in 25 years as it is today. That's why we went out and we hired Robert Am Stern. My design and philosophy can be summed up as that you go backwards to go forward. And that's what we did in One Bennett Park. It's a skyscraper that fits into a broader tradition of skyscrapers. But the idea of the limestone is that in a city of black towers, this will stand out. You see the sun pours onto it. You get shade and shadow. We will be able to light the top in an interesting way. We found a limestone in Kansas, which is quite beautiful. It has a kind of interesting pattern in it. I love Chicago, and Chicago loves architecture. I hope our building will bring a new spritz to the skyline. I don't so much think of a park as an escape from the city as I think of it as an escape in the city. The difference the seasons make in Chicago, the importance of a place that invites you outside to choose things that flower early, hold their leaves late, have great fall color. I think I felt a strong connection to Chicago even from my very first commission. The more recent projects are the Maggie Daly Park, which is of course a great celebration of families and kids. You navigate the experience of something by the way you know it's going to make people feel. If you ask me what the central feature of this park was, it's this open bowl at the center. There's a small grove of five trees. Children can run in there and feel like it's a small world. The building really sits right in the park. And then you go up through the building, rise to your apartment, looking out over the city and the lake. It really is part of the romance of skyscraper living. Related is extremely vested in Streeterville. We think that this neighborhood gets better and better it's the only place in the city where you're right on the lake and you're right off of downtown. And you have this beautiful architecture and these beautiful parks. You can run and bike and walk your dog. You are steps away from one of the great beaches in Chicago. There's a beautiful dining spot, a great place to find a cocktail. What Chicago has become is a true urban city. And that means a place where children grow up in the city. From nearly every residence, you get a view of park, of the lake, and of the city. So this is the only one that's gonna give you all of those things.